Conger, hey brother. Um, okay, the final solo in Get Back has a neat variation that we liked. You do the A only three times, that's an anomaly. You go. And the third one's long, so it's short, short, long. Then you hammer on to the B, and then play it twice and bend. So it's. And then there's no pinky at all, you re bend the string like this. Again. And then you do that bend over and over again. That's just landing on the A, bending the B, landing on the A. One, two, three, four. And then it's the same phrase from before, but with these simple three notes. So it's. So the whole final phrase of that second solo is um. And the exercise we came up with there was to bend your ring finger and then land your first finger. And you don't let this descend. You kind of just choke it before it can descend at all. Sorry. Do that down the whole step. And then just add notes to it. Then do the whole phrase slowly. I think I added that accidentally. Um, when you're practicing the chorus, <clears throat> make sure there's just five beats here. One, two, three, four, five. So there's a little gap, so it's like... It's the end of three, so it's one and two and three and one and two and three and one and two and three and one and two one and two and three and one and two and three one two three four five one and two and three and that's a way to practice that. Um, let's see, that's most of what we did with get back I believe yes okay and then we talked more about dig a pony so we made some adjustments you start here at the G the third fret and you play your active scale with it with a grace note slide on your ring finger and then before you have time to think you do it again on D it's a seamless phrase open A three times that's long short long so, all I want is you. We move just to the open position. That's the first half, and the second half comes down the scale. And so, when you put them together, it's. So, it's. This week you're gonna omit the sexy little move on the A and just do. A sharp minor. As long as you follow the chart, even through the asymmetries, they should all line up beautifully. Yes, you can. And you play this verse like there's eight verses in the song. Always two back to back. Oh, now. And then after the second one, it's. I told you so, of course. Oh, this is the intro, it's the chorus, it's most of the song. Everything's got to be just like you want it to. You get it, dude. Have fun.